Hi, I'm Sydney Emanuel. I'm five foot, eight inches, self Oh my God, sorry, I thought I was self-taping for I've a second. There. I've we been are there. doing post-market news. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, Marcus. Yeah, the only thing more painful than a self-tape is uh be <clears throat> nice. Welcome, Samurai. How are you today? Uh, how are you guys doing? That felt like a loaded intro. Samurai. We've had a long day, and we're mm -hmm. so happy to have you here because we need a reprieve yeah. from just everything going on in the world, yeah. you know? I need to know some some positive stuff about the future. We, we also need a nice little button on our show and fill a little bit of time. So uh, you're here to give us a bold prediction about the future. What is it? I got bad news for you guys. This prediction is not going to go down easy. Oh. This is going to be a tough-to-accept prediction, Oh. and I have no buttons on my jacket. Oh, you're right. Got me there. Brace yourself for this. Okay. We've all been waiting a long time for Bioshock 3. Would you agree? Mm, no, Bioshock 3 is Bioshock Infinite. What are you talking about? Okay, uh, Bioshock 4. Nobody cares about Bioshock 2, Marcus. Get with the program. What? No, a lot of people care about. No, they don't care about Bioshock 2. Marcus, what are you talking about? Talking about. A, long, a lot of people have been waiting for a follow up to Bioshock Infinite this okay. time. With yes. The words and his okay. timelines. Sure. Yes. Yeah. It's been a long time, been over a decade since the last Bioshock game. And this we've been true. waiting a long time. Mm -hmm. After a long break, my visions are telling me, as I can peer into the future, the next Bioshock game. Like how the first one, we know, took place underwater right. in a city mm -hmm. called yeah. Rapture. Correct. And then the infinite one, because we don't care about the second one. Which is also in Rapture. Which yeah. is also in Rapture. The second one took place in a sky city called right. Columbia. Mm -hmm. And then you go back to Rapture in the DLC. Spoilers, but yes. Third game, fourth game, whatever, is going to take place on the microscopic level. It's going to be a tiny game. It's going <laughs> to take place inside of a grain of rice in a microscopic city where the player character will have to fight microbes with powers and to escape and become large again. And the whole premise of the game, the whole objective of the character is to become large. And every couple seconds, you're gonna hear him say, I gotta get large again. Who's saying that? <laughs> The player that you're playing. Wait, what is he gonna say what every few say? seconds? You're, I gotta get large. I, I, I gotta become large. <laughs> Wait, why? Wait, why? Why are you small? Like, how did he get small? Because I... <laughs> why is he small? If the whole premise is that he's got to get big again, you have to say why he's small. What happened? Because obviously he was visiting the rice factory and he what? fell into their shrink ray. That's how they make rice so small. Oh, it's like Spider-Man 3 with Sandman. Exactly. Oh, so right. Yeah, Hayden no, Christian Church obviously. or whatever his this name is. is. Like, yeah. Yeah, this is superhero. This is only superhero logic. He got logic. spun around in the thing and he went, ah! Why? Okay, hold on. I'm sorry. With the Bioshock universe... Mm -hmm. There's, it has nothing to do with rice or getting small. It Why? had nothing to do with cities in the sky until they went there. Okay, uh, that's actually, well. I mean, sort of, I, I just wanna, can I hear the catchphrase one can more time? you just time? say what happens when he's small? What does yeah, he need to do? What does he say? Every, <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Every couple of seconds, <laughs> you will hear him say, I just gotta get large. <laughs> Thank you so much, Samurai. I don't know I why that's, that's killing me today, I think but you got it. me. I think that's all we I, have time for. I, you broke me, and so I can't help but agree with this yeah. prediction. On the Simpsons predictability uh, meter, I would give it... <laughs> remember that Treehouse of Horror where, where Lisa's taking care of a little microscopic uh, oh, community yes, based on Twilight Zone? In the Petri dish. Yeah, yeah, and then Bart comes over and like becomes their god. Yeah. I'll... Whatever Honestly, that is, that's my uh, the same ranking. Thing. Yeah, it's so it's a tooth in soda, and then the whole civilization yeah. builds. So I'm gonna give it the same Which, rating. You know, pretty good episode. So, I mean, uh, Treehouse of Horror is great. Um, yeah. Thanks so much, Samurai. This has been Post Market News. We are Next Level Play. Marcus, I'll see, we'll I'll see, see you next time as next we time. make more bold predictions about the future, analyze what we see in the industry, have some amazing guests, and just talk about video games. Thanks gotta for watching. Gotta get large. I gotta get large. I gotta get large, I gotta get large now.